Commonwealth Cup, Group 1, 6 furlong for 3-year-olds. Cashmere Masquerade up the top for Steve Rand. I reckon that'll be my horse. So I've been sitting on Steve Rand's stable for the last few races. Courtship Woland, Escape Captivity, Pacific Star, Dazzling, Lawrence Firing, Orvita Blur, Snugfit Petronella and Tongling Danger is our favourite, Finney Gerard. He's China... Um, orientated horses and Kashmir Masquerade jumps out remember watching this uh, Lebanese trader this woman in a uh, five star hotel in New Delhi hassle the hell out of some bloke for Kashmir robes or not robes uh, shawls Interesting to watch how brutal she was. Anyway, it's Kashmir Masquerade in front of Escape Captivity, Courtship Wodeland, Dazzling or Vita Blur, Pacific Star at the two furlong. Kashmir Masquerade is hanging on for dear life. Courtship Wodeland and Escape Captivity get up on us outside and take the lead at the furlong. Running on or Vita Blur. Blur, but it's courtship woe land and escape captivity and trying to get a gap here is dazzling dazzling's getting through on the fence but it's going to be too late and escape captivity wins from dazzling i reckon the favorite the pre-race favorite has flown for maybe third fourth but escape captivity with a big win Paul Rhodes picks up a winner from Dazzling Joshua Sutherland. Looked like it was going to beat the lot, but just died in the shadows of the pace. Died on this run. Courtship, Wodeland, James Shea was third. Consistent run. Tongling Danger for Vinnie Gerard. Left it too late. And Orvita Blur for Dan Hughes. Looked the winner there for a while, but just couldn't go on with it.